What is good everybody and welcome to another Two Minute Tuesday where we're going to talk about one of my favourite pieces of technology, React Native. React Native was built by Facebook and is a cross-platform mobile development framework. It allows you to generate applications for both Android and iOS, sharing mostly the same code base. This code base is written in JavaScript or TypeScript and as such allows you, to, allows you access to a wealth of JavaScript packages. When you do need to dip into the native side, React Native provides a bridge that allows easy access to both sides. React Native comes in two flavors, React Native CLI, which produces an application that is, has easy access to native modules, and Expo. Although Expo is not developed by Facebook, it is developed closely with them. Expo is a software development framework that allow, has most of the modules that you would need to build applications already built in. This means that the development process is very, very smooth and allows people with not a huge amount of mobile development knowledge to build seamless looking apps. One of the main criticisms of React Native was that animations were not buttery smooth like you expect from native applications. This is no longer the case with libraries like Reanimated, allowing you to have animations that run at 60 frames per second, even on old Android devices. I mentioned that shared code base Depending on the application, you could probably see 80% shared between code bases. The reason I say 80% is because some of the times you have to pander to the needs of these native platforms and, and write uh, platform specific code. Although this is a quick rundown of how great React Native is, the developer experience and development time really is fantastic. And this, these are some of the reasons why we use it at Gravity Realm.